you teach us, Doc Rob, some um, basic exercises that we can just do at home or basic even stretching. when we are just sitting so that we can, you know, help our backs to alleviate the pain, yeah. uh, to, to, to lessen the pain? Yeah, I mean, it's really stretching is, um, the important thing with stretching is you have to do it regularly. You know, whether that's five times a week, consistency is the key, or, or, or seven days a week, mm -hmm. and it doesn't have to be very long. You can just do five minute stretching routine and that's really gonna help. And it's really just range of motion. For example, with the neck, you know, you're just looking to the right, holding for 30 seconds. Mm -hmm. You go to the left, you do flexion, extension, and then you stretch, you know, like I said earlier here, the posture back and then the lower back, you know, doing some uh, knee to chest, things like that. But it's all about consistency for when it comes to mm, that. Yeah. Consistency is the key. And always check, right, your posture through chiropractic. Yeah, the chiropractic is really vital so that we can always work on these natural curves. So you're going to sit straight. This one's really important. And then, of course, the shoulders and always working on the natural curve in the neck. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right. Doc, are posture problems more common among adults or the children need to be diagnosed yeah. or, or carefully Check. monitored if they have postural problems or as early as possible. Yeah, it's actually starting quite early. These mm -hmm. postural changes are starting. By 15, usually we've lost the natural curve. Oh. Yeah, by 15 years of age, our neck is pretty straight. Yes. Mm -hmm. And so then again, you see kids now with the gadgets and then the online schooling. Of course, now their posture is being affected. So they're losing the natural curve here and they're really bending forward. Mm -hmm. And so, yeah, that's going to affect um, the posture and so but the earlier you start to take care of it the better so you know 10, 5, 13 years of age is it's very effective in really trying to improve that posture. Look, especially these days kids are really into mobile gaming. Mm -hmm. yeah. They just sit like uh, they slouch yeah. and yeah. They, they... So that's repetitive yes, stress physical activities yeah. affecting their children. posture. Posture. Mm, especially right. during the pandemic, right? Yeah. They are very more on to using mm -hmm. their gadgets. Yeah, and so all that stimulus that they're going through, it's going to possibly cause, you know, affect um, anxiety, you know, and then with the posture going forward, it affects breathing. Mm -hmm. And so asthma, things like that, chiropractic can really help naturally just by improving the posture, improving nerve communication. That's how we help with those things. Mm -hmm. So it's very good for kids. Yeah. So it's really recommended as long as early as, as possible. Early as possible. Like, mm -hmm. have, have them checked by a chiropractor yeah. to help them to prevent them from developing repetitive stress injuries That's or right. other postural problems. That's right. Yeah. But Doc Rob, what I love about chiropractic is, is that the, the body heals itself. That's right. Just yeah. by adjustments, right? That's yeah. right. Yeah, it's really incredible. So yeah, there's a saying, we don't cure anything. Mm -hmm. We allow your body to cure itself. You know, so what we're doing is ultimately we're just releasing the nerve interference because again the misalignment really compromises the nerve communication and these nerves are communicating to your heart your lungs your liver your kidneys your stomach your reproductive organs your colon so everything communicates via the central nervous system so when we adjust these areas it's going to instantly improve nerve mm -hmm. function to your heart so we help with blood pressure to your lungs so we help with respiratory to your stomach we help with digestion really really amazing um, I'm curious, Doc, what part of spine is, you know, got connected, has the nerve that is connected through to the legs? Yeah. I'm curious. Yeah, about all of these. It's a huge nerve plexus right. down here. You can see the sacrum. There's a huge giant nerve plexus that goes down and innervates mm -hmm. all the muscles in your legs. Man, so when we have... We're part of the spine. Yeah, so when you have all that stress accumulation down here, you know, affecting the nerve, it's going to possibly cause numbness, tingling, or yeah. shooty, shooting pain, sciatica. That's problem, Doc. Yeah. So, yeah. You're so young. <laughs> you're having... I feel so stiff in this part of my legs. Just you know? on the left? Yeah. Okay, yeah. So, so it could be that... very simply a misalignment. Okay. Yeah, and see every day you're sitting with your leg crossed mm. like that. <clears throat> Very heels, yes. I think, also. So we probably Hindi Pantai. Oh, yes. Uh, oh. So we need the Pantai. <laughs> Hindi Pantai. <laughs> Kailangan pantayin. Oh. Doc, aside from getting chiropractic care, are there any other ways or advice to our viewers that can help them heal their, their body, heal themselves? Mm. Help, them, help their body to heal itself? Heal itself? Hmm. I mean, thoughts are pretty powerful, mm -hmm. having mm -hmm. a proper mindset, you know, meditation, positive affirmations. I mean, that, that's pretty powerful. It's prayer. Yes, <laughs> prayer. Of course. Um, 
you know, stretching, that's, that's really good. I mean, that doesn't affect the nervous system mm -hmm. and so much healing, but stretching mm -hmm. is really good and it really works well with chiropractic. Mm -hmm. And really avoid the stressors like chemical stressors like with you. Sugar, mm -hmm. sugar. You know, sugar. <laughs> alcohol, yeah. yeah. Uh, you know, so all these are chemical stressors. Mm -hmm. uh, sugar is very, very bad, you know, in the mm -hmm. processed foods and the, yeah. So what we're putting into our body is the fuel. And so it's really important to eat mm -hmm. really healthy 90% of the time. Sure, you can splurge every now and then, but for the most part, you know, you got to really be aware of what you're putting into your body. Moderation, Otherwise, variety, and balance. Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, you're going to have high blood pressure, diabetes. Mm -hmm. You know, you're going to have all of these issues. Mm -hmm. Then you're going to have to take medications, so that's not good. Mm -hmm. So these are all part of a lifestyle, and chiropractic is the vital part of that by improving nerve communication mm -hmm. so the body can heal. Mm -hmm. But you have to eat right, you have to exercise. You have to help your You have to sleep yourself. in the right positions and sleep the right amount of time. Mm -hmm. uh, and you have to have the right mindset. Mm -hmm. that, and that's what my book is all about. You know, I wrote a book about mm -hmm. this, you know, wow. Doc Rob's Guide to Better Health and Living. So, yeah, so we talk about that. And so our clinics are really designed to promote this healthy lifestyle because it, it really requires consistency. Consistency, Consistency is, is the key. That is right. <laughs>